While the rates of most types of cancer are on the way down, melanoma is one exception. 70,000 new cases of melanoma are diagnosed every year and 10,000 people die from it. Most can be prevented by cutting exposure to the sun's harmful ultraviolet rays. And some communities across the country are supplying outdoor lovers with one proven weapon against skin cancer. Miami Beach is perfect for lovers of surf, sand, and sun. For Edward Cassidy and Teresa Jimenez, it was a great place to spend an extra vacation day. Our luggage got stuck in the airport, yeah. so we didn't have anything. We had to go buy a bathing suit. We didn't buy any sunscreen, so that's yeah. like perfect. Edward and Teresa happened to be on the first beach in the country to provide sunscreen free in large mark dispensers. Sunscreens, the good ones, are expensive, and, and I think that actually plays a, a role in, in a lot of people not using sunscreens. Dr. Jose Lutsky says sunscreen is essential for protection against harmful ultraviolet rays. It has to be a sunscreen that has protection against ultraviolet A and ultraviolet B. The sunscreen in the dispensers has both types of protection, an SPF of 30, and they're waterproof, designed to protect for 80 minutes. Gavin Pratt spent his teens and 20s basking in the sun unprotected. I, I used to rollerblade a lot. I used to be in the sun. I, I love to go to the beach. Now at 37, he's being treated for melanoma. Dr. Lutsky says with rates of this cancer increasing, putting sunscreen in public places could be a good preventive start. The dispensers in Miami Beach were funded by Mount Sinai Medical Center. In addition to Miami, Boston has installed lotion dispensers in parks. 